And now it's time for Modest Farm, with guest appearances from Ink Horse, Clay Duck and Paper Pig, Earth Bird, and of course, Wire Chicken, hosted by our dear friend, Farmer Layla. Have a marvelous time. Hello, welcome back to Modest Farms. My name is Farmer Layla, and today we're gonna to be drawing barred rock chickens out of markers. So all you need are some markers, any kind will do, uh, and a piece of paper. All right, let's get started. All right, so now we are going to be drawing our barred rock chicken. Um, all right, so, Start. You want a black marker of some sort, and we are going to start with the neck, and that will help its face come out better. All right, so almost make like a curved, kind of straight, like curved at the bottom, and then straightens at the top, and then kind of maybe one or two inches up. You want to take and make um, a little, a little bump, and just kind of make another little bump right there. And that is your neck. Here, and we're barred off. Just kind of bring this one down. Right there. And now I am going to take a light pink and a darker pink for the face. Now barred rocks have a usually have a very red, a bright red face. So I'm almost gonna take my light pink right here. I'm gonna make this um, asymmetrical, uneven curved line right there. And I'm also, so then I'm going to make the comb of the bird, that little funny little thing you see on top, and just kind of curve up and just do a bunch of like little finger like bumpy things. Every bird has a different comb, so it doesn't have to be perfect. And then once you get maybe half an inch past the end of the waddle, bring it back up like this yes that will be your comb I'm also going to outline my waddle in dark pink and I'm going to take my light pink and color in the comb just kind of not do all of it but just do little areas underneath the bumps like that so now, I am going to take my light gray and my yellow. I am going to do the beak. So the comb on the bird usually comes down to the beginning of the beak. And so I'm gonna take my gray. I'm going to make a little bent triangle right here. Like a bird beak, like that. And just almost not quite connect it to the comb. Leave about half a centimeter in between. And then I'm going to go about halfway and make a line right where the beak is gonna be. Uh, and then make a little dot right here and that is the nose hole. So then I'm going to highlight it in yellow. And I'm going to take my light pink and just kind of connect it to the comb and do a little line here. And that is its earlobe almost on the chicken. It's just this interesting little line. I'm going to take now my, I'm going to get a gray. I'm going to do a little circle right here. and. And do a little, a 
large dot and take your brown and kind of fill it in. And then do a little yellow just to give it a highlight. And you've got the eye. And we are going to kind of take a line right here and make a little squiggly. And then from the comb, from the beginning of the waddle and from the bottom of the comb, we're just going to kind of do some little squiggly lines. And that gives it a very uh, wrinkly kind of textured face. And that is kind of what a chicken face looks like. And so now we're going to do what barred rocks are known for, its distinctive striped feather pattern. So we're going to kind of bring this down gently, slope going down, and bring it down here. And then we're going to take this line and bring the chest like to about here. And Bring the bird down, and we're going to make a leg, and so I'm just going to do like a gentle U, come back up, and kind of draw your way in here, and come up this way, and that will be our tail, which is just almost like a U upside down and just do little bumps for the feathers and then we will just curve down here like with the Polish hen and make a little a little wing and so now we are going to give it its stripes so I'm just going to take the side of my marker and I'm going to like do my squiggly lines and just kind of do some quick little stripes here. Very simple. And this bird will have a very stripey kind of look. And that is why actually, that's why they call it the barred rock. So this is just a certain type of these kind of birds. The general name of the breed is actually the, the Plymouth Rock. And that's where the breed was created. Plymouth Rock, Massachusetts. And um, there's uh, several different types of this bird. And this is just one variation. There's also a partridge rock, which is more brown, and it's got some black markings. Then there's a buff rock, which is more of a yellow kind of variation. And um, there's also white rocks, which are white birds. But they all originated in the Massachusetts area. And I actually have a bird just like this one. I have a barred rock. Her name is Olive. And I also have a partridge rock. Her name is Rosie. And she's like this pretty brown bird. So we're going to come down. We're going to take our yellow. And we're going to do the leg. Just like we did with our Polish hen. We're going to do a little finger like here. And then do another little finger and then one in the back. This is kind of what your typical chicken leg looks like. Um, and then for the claws, um, you'll just take your gray and just kind of give it a little, little um, toes. Um, and then just take some gray, do some polka dots, and just kind of get in there and that will define the scales on the leg then you will just kind of fill in with yellow focusing on the back of the leg and then the bottom here just kind of alternate it with the gray and we'll just stripes up here and that is your barred rock chicken there you go well there you have it
have it. This is our finished barred rock chicken made of markers. Now, I'll take you to my farm now and we can look at our real barred rock chicken. Hey creators, this is Miss Vicky. I'm about to video chat with Farmer Layla. Hopefully she's on the farm by now. I can't wait to find out more about her chickens. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Modest Farms. My name is Farmer Layla, and today I'm going to be showing you the barred rock chicken that we drew in real life. So, let's get right to it. So while I'm on my way to go find our barred rock chicken, I will tell you a little bit about the history of the barred rock chicken. So, barred rocks were, uh, so they say, originally became a breed um, when settlers from England moved to Massachusetts and those were the settlers of Plymouth Rock and so these chickens were very popular hence the name the Bar Rock Chicken actually the full name the Bar Rock Chicken is the Bar Plymouth Rock and so that's where they get their name and they were bred to lay eggs and so they're typically very good and consistent egg layers. So, down here it looks like, found our partridge rock. It's hard to see her, she blends in with the leaves. Um, there she is, right there. So, her name is Rosie. She's very sweet, she's very friendly. And it looks like she is digging through some bugs over here. You can find a lot of good bugs under a bunch of dead leaves. And they like to hang out here by the side of the yard, picking up all kinds of things. So yeah, Rosie um, is a variation of the barn rock, and as you can see, the feathers are outlined in black, and that is called penciling. So she has penciled feathers, and um, we've got some pretty shades of amber around her neck, too. But um, she lays very, uh, very smooth, bronzish kind of eggs, and she's also a very good, consistent layer as well. So yeah, that is my uh, partridge rock chicken. So I hope you enjoyed seeing my barred and partridge rock chickens today, and I thank you for watching. See you in the next episode of Modest Farms. Bye bye.